home, baby. Yeah. We're back. Okay, so uh, we're gonna keep messing with this engine. And uh, I think I've got an antenna on this one. I think I wanna try and take that antenna off and then just put the hood on top of this. I think that'll be easier. And then we just got those six bolts around the outside. I think we should be good to go. I mean, not, not really too difficult. Pretty easy, yeah. So with taking the hood off, I just, I don't know any other way to do it without a second hand. So I gotta get a second pair of hands here real quick. Okay, cool. Uh, so hood's off. Now I'm just gonna put the lift together, hook that bad boy up. Then we'll have the six bolts, and we'll have the fuel line, and uh, we'll be good to go. Bam. It is definitely starting to warm up out here. I'm glad I'm doing this before we get our Arizona 120 heat. So I got it all bolted up, boom. And uh, just looking back here, I think I can reach probably a lot of the bolts right there. So hopefully that makes it real easy. Also, when I was taking that hood off, I thought I broke off one of these bolts and I didn't. It's still good. It kind of popped when I took it off. But we're good, we're good. Dang, even with the uh, glove on, I got my hand pretty good. There's like a bolt coming out of the firewall when I Pulled it up, I smacked it. I'm back, I'm back, bandaged up, and I got a tire to put the engine on. Boom. I am glad I'm doing this now because it's not even summer. It's not even that. It's like maybe 80, which honestly is like nothing. If I was trying to do this in the summer heat, a 120, oh man, I'd be dying. Those bolt uh, back bolts, you definitely should be using a uh, torque wrench. I don't have a torque wrench. I'm not going to go buy a torque wrench because uh, COVID, COVID. Um, so yeah, that's why I'm ranking on them. But I think we're sitting pretty good, boom. All right, so just to give you an idea what I'm looking at, uh, let's see, where's that bolt? I'm trying to look through the screen and, and look at what I'm looking at. Okay, is that it? Yeah, there you go. So I don't know if you can see, but all these uh, bolts in here are just covered with like the slime. But I got this one loose. That's half the battle in that first movement. 
But look at all that gunk. Like, it's crazy, man. All right, I got the uh, bolts, I think, on that side. I'm trying to find these ones. Uh, I'm just trying to dig through the, the gunky stuff to find the bolts. So that's what I'm working on now. All right, back to crawling on the ground. There's no more that I can see from the top, so I'm gonna have to crawl under there. But at least I have some shade. I mean, it is a little hot. I will tell you this, <sighs> this ground, is killing me. All right, so good thing since I got the uh, the hood off, there's a lot more light under here, as you can see. And I found a couple more bolts. Check it out. There's one right there. You can see pretty easily right here. Oh, right there. And then you can't really see it from where I got you, but right above it, there's another one. Oh, actually, I think that bottom one already loosened up pretty good. Cool. Looks like we're making pretty good progress, actually. Uh, let's see. I mean, not bad. And then I'm going to have to circle back to that motor mount. You can see I got the middle off. But I was told, see, there's bolts on either side. I was told I have to take those two off also. <sighs> crawling under here back and forth so i got one more of the bolts out on this side i uh i try and also stream live periodically just to keep it entertaining so sometimes it lose a little bit of the footage due to that but not much not much i'm trying to get this top bolt and uh my buddy Adolfo was giving me some good advice. He was saying, make sure when you uh, when you pull the engine out, you don't torque it too much. Pull and try and pull it straight out first, so you don't uh, torque the uh, the transmission at all. Which makes sense. I got it. I got it. Um. I have to say, having the the hood off the thing, the hood off is is nice because well, it's so much more light in here. Let's see so much more. It kind of looks cool without the hood off, but I still prefer the hood on. All right. This angle is just killing me for some reason. I'm gonna try and. Uh, see if I can get a better spot it's all about angles so I'm trying going this way I'll show you all right so behind the wheel ah, and if you can see that bolt right there that's where I'm trying to get to which I think I can do it it's only all the way over there back under the truck because that didn't work and i just i'm making it work this way all right so i got that one and now i just have to figure out what, which one i'm missing because i'm sure i'm missing one somewhere i think on this side i'm good i'm gonna crawl over on the other side because i think it's just the bottom bolt on the opposite side that i'm missing and then i was looking at these motor mounts with the dolpho and he was thinking that I probably, uh, that I'm probably good with just that middle one. But we'll see. I'm just going to, after I get this other side, I'll double check. If I feel like I've got all of them, I'm just going to do it really slowly and see if it pops out or not. You know, if I wasn't so close to getting this thing out, I would have stopped. Because crawling around on this ground really wears you out, but I'm so close, man. It's like it's hard not to. All right, so I'm on this side. I'm going to check for the bolts on this side. Maybe I actually got them all. 
check it out. All right, so uh, there's that. So you can see I took that bolt out and I don't see any other bolts. Huh. Okay, I found the last one. You can't see it just because of the way the lighting is, but it, and because it's all gunked up, but there's one right there. So I just gotta get that one, and I think I think that's the last one. I am running out of steam. Man, it's just one bolt. I think it's just one bolt. And this bolt does not want to come off. All right, I have to call the stopping point. It's getting counterproductive. Ugh. It's kind of crazy to think though. I mean, there's really just one bolt. I can't believe it, man. One bolt holding me up here. But I'm getting frustrated and uh, I'm running out of daylight. I've been out here a while, so. I'll come back out. I'm just going to leave the lift there. If it starts to rain, I'll just cover everything up or something. So like and subscribe, people. I mean, come on. Hey, thank you for watching. I really do appreciate that. Um, as you know, YouTube's all about subscribers. So if you could subscribe if you're not already, really appreciate that piece. And, uh, and boom, baby. I mean, that's it. Boom.